this was television, this would be the best drama you've ever seen. You know, you, the thing in television, they love that moment where, will it, won't it, will it, won't it? Because we are, in, in truth, right against it. I mean, we're, we're what, two weeks away. We're still not tr we've not tried any of the balls out yet. As you can see from this section, which is Watford Junction to Bushy, we, we are nowhere near yet finished. I've finished all, the, all of the um, gantries, but they're not in. We've been working on the road, the island at Bushy. We've still got bits and pieces to do, but, you know, as you can see, all the boards are up in the air at the minute because we're, we're wiring all the bushes. We've got no signals yet, so we're, we're, we're a good three weeks in our normal working capacity away from where we should be. The good news is, of course, we can do extra days and we're going on probably five days, six days a week just to get it to finish. So I'd like to say, like in all good television, will they make it? Well, of course we'll make it, but we'll have to make it because we've, we've promised to be there. So um, there's a lot of work. There's a lot more work in this than we ever, ever envisaged. I mean, um, that extra round the corner, you know, 32 feet is an enormous, enormous challenge. More than I ever thought it would be. It's because, um, of course, it doesn't turn out to be 32 feet. It turns out to be 32 feet plus this piece, which is 12 feet. So you, it's not just adding 32 feet of board. You're adding 32 feet of board four times plus all the scenery, you know. Plus this amazing viaduct, we, it is amazing, but it's a lot of work. You know, some of the, just, just all the, the road markings have taken literally six hours to do and we haven't finished. We haven't even got the yellow lines on yet. And Phil still hasn't made the parking meters. We will get there. Um, but there's still a work, there's still a lot of work. Listen, all the track is finished. All of the catenary is finished, but we don't have the droppers on. These are the droppers that hold the wire. They're not all on yet. Aaron's 40 short of those. He's got to make those. There is no scenic part yet to the entrance to Bushy. We haven't even started that yet. Although I can do it, but it's more trees and more bushes and different bits and pieces. So two thirds of the layout is, is wired. That's about... But we've got no signals. We haven't wired any signals yet. We've not tested it yet. So, you know, that, that's not an exaggeration. We have not run one train other than through Bushy, uh, through Watford Junction that somebody wanted to photograph. I think it might have been even you. That's the only time we've used it because we've been so busy building it. We still have bits to do. The wiring is a priority. The second priority... And I guess their equal priorities really is the signals, because the signals, you know, we, we, we push the signals all the way along the line. You know, that's been our sort of signature is our working signals. So when you th we say it simply like this, we're adding another twenty six signals. <laughs> it, it, you know, think about that. We haven't even built them yet. And we're going to add 26 signals. You know, that's, um, that's more than most people ever have on, on their layouts in, in their lives. You know, and if you think about 208 feet now, I don't know, if, uh, we've probably had, we've probably got 36, 40 signals already on the layout, roughly. About 40 and we're adding another 26. So we're going to go to round about 70 signals, all working together and those are the two priorities because yes we could do that signal but it, do, it doesn't work for us if we don't have the signals so you know Andy's working flat out and Phil's working flat out we're all working flat out to make sure it, it, it get, we get where we want oh, I'm more excited now than 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 ever because I think when you, you, you can't see this on this video and you won't see it till you get there but when you stand and you put Bushy together, you know, because obviously that's how we build it. 
you see the sweep and the simplicity of, of what Bushy is and you just go, fantastic. That's a, that's a real railway. It's no clutter, just two bush shelters, you know, two ways of getting onto the platform and lots of little signs telling you to be careful and that's it. And it's 16 feet long. You know, you couldn't do that in your, your barn or, or your, you just, you just wouldn't do it. I mean, it's just, it's alien to what model railway is. It's a long piece of nothing, but it's really, really difficult to do. You know, so you can look, it, it looks like nothing, but the gantries are a nightmare to build. You know, it's, it's just to make it look right and uncluttered, yet busy is the hardest part. I think this year we were, we were really planning to do more on new stock. Uh, I mean, there's going to be a lot of new stock, don't get me wrong, but we were planning some shocks, some really different things. We're not going to have time for that. So that will be the cathedral and gets before you see those. You will see some quite unusual trains and some new stuff. But I don't want to t say exactly what, but we're not going to see as much as we planned because, again, we, we're just running out of time. I mean, I, the other thing, big job, I think about this and it's, you've now got 70, something, 80 feet, 90 feet of new railway. I haven't got a cloud in the sky. I haven't even painted the backboards yet. <laughs> All the backboards have got to be painted. So we've got to build it, got to take all the backboards off, because obviously I have to do those all in a line so they match up. Well, the weather's been so bad, I just haven't been able to do it. In some ways, you know, it's, it's a challenge um, that you accept and, you, you know, we're lucky enough to be able to do it. So, and, and, you know, that's, that's all I care about. You know, we can moan about it, and I wish I had, a, a, you know got the rest of it if I knocked a couple of walls down we could get it all in but you know I'm too old for that now so you have to build it in sections and they're, they're and doing that there is a, a discipline that you have to impart on yourself to achieve that which I suppose in some ways is the same discipline if you've only got a loft that's 12 foot long it's the same discipline isn't it I was amazed it gets when we got to the you know the 100 feet but 208 feet seeing it I can't, I just can't envisage it. You know, I really can't. We've never seen it. So until we get there and start putting it up, what does 208 feet look like? I have no idea. Model World Live takes place on April 27th and 28th, 2024 at the NEC in Birmingham. This brand new modelling event features stunning model railways, outstanding scale modelling, radio control displays, full-size exhibits, and more than 70 trade stands. Book your advance tickets for Model World Live today and save. Visit keybottleworld.com slash modelworldlive for full event details and ticket sales.